Hey guys, welcome back to another Quick Tip Tuesday. So I'm halfway through another look and I thought I would show you how I use the Illamasqua Eyebrow Cake because a lot of people ask me what I use and when they find out and buy, maybe buy it for themselves, they're not quite sure. So if you want to know how to get my eyebrow look and find out how I use the Illamasqua Eyebrow Cake, then please keep on watching. So for my eyebrows, I use three different brushy type things. I use, sorry about my hair guys, it needs <laughs> some TLC. Um, so I use the Benefit Hard Angle Definer and I use this with the product dry. I use this spoolie which is looking rather disgusting at the minute because I need to swap it or clean it or whatever. And then the MAC 268, I think. I will find the exact one but this is the angle brush that I use. And of course I use my eyebrow cake in stock. First, well I've already done my other eyebrow so that's why that's on there. So first I take some Bioderma on a cotton pad and then I wipe my smaller brush on it to get it wet. Then I brush my brows to get any foundation and stuff out of them. Take my brush straight into the product and start in where I want my brow to almost start but not quite. I just do a straight line to the tail of my brow. So as you can see, my brows are pretty much not there. My hairs are really fine. So I can get away with going a bit cray with the shape. So once I've got my basic arch kind of shape down, I just keep dipping back into that bioderma and I do the top of my brows and fill them in. as I go along. So I've still got this empty space at the front of my brow and what I do is I fill that in with what I've got left on the brush to get that gradient. So my thinking is darker towards the outer edge and then thinner, um, not thinner, <laughs> and then lighter and less product towards the inner corner. Then I just go back in that bioderma, back in my eyebrow cake, which looks very sorry for itself, and start darkening up. And trying to stay in shot while doing so. Then I brush my inner corner through. So we get rid of most of that product again. And then I take this, the Benefit brush. And I thought kind of where the, where I want most of the powder. So I want most of the powder at the front because it gives a nicer, softer gradient to it, looking more natural. And then I, take the powder all the way through my brow. If you just want to use the powder on its own it does look more red rather than auburn. And then I just make sure that that all blends really nicely. And if I do feel like my bottom edge is a little bit fuzzy I don't necessarily do concealer brow but I just take what's left on my concealer brush and just run that along the bottom really gently just to define it. So this is the finished brow. Obviously I realise it's not to everyone's taste and I'm not saying that you have to do your eyebrows like that because that's silly. You can do your eyebrows how you'd like. It's just a lot of people have been asking so I thought I'd show you. So I hope you got something from this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.